yeah, you know, it was really nice to have everybody get another opportunity to play, and uh, I'd like to thank Algoma for coming over. Uh, we couldn't, we couldn't, it was really difficult scheduling at this time, and I thought the, the three, three, four weeks off would, would be too long, and it was a last ad, and I appreciate them coming over because uh, not only was it a, 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 a game, uh, we, it, we had a good practices this week, and I think that was really critical for, for this team coming off you know, our, our, our previous game. So uh, I'd like to thank them, but I'm very, very excited that, every, that we, it looked like the tech team and you know, the passing, the shooting, the, and, and that's a good way to, to, to leave for the holiday. Coach, uh, kind of like with Andy, you got a lot of people in today. Yeah. Again, more valuable minutes yeah. for those guys. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, it's critical because we're going to need the depth coming down the stretch. And, you know, we, it, I really appreciated our effort with those kids because I think this can give them some, some confidence. And, you know, it was tough to keep the, that first group in there too long because I didn't want anybody to get hurt. But yet we, you know, tried to mix it up and use some different combinations. And believe it or not, I even sub five at a time. And I haven't really done that in my career too much. So... Thought it was important to try a couple different things today. I know Eric Carl had another good game off the bench and just yeah. really bright spot kind of to see him. Yeah, two up. two things. Uh, two things were I, I thought Eric Carl was was outstanding again today, and I, and hopefully he will continue to get the confidence that's needed to, you know, to be in that solid rotation on a on a regular basis. And I it was nice. I I felt that uh, Kyle Kyle Monroe was a little bit like the old Kyle Monroe, you know, playing a little more fluid. And uh, you know that's obviously a key for us. So uh, I like the balance. I like again Tommy, Tommy, Luca, eight, eight assists, zero turnovers. Owen White uh, being unselfish and guarding their best player, and you know Isaac Appleby, Dawson Bilski, Trent Bell. You know doing the things that, that we have to do to be good, and, and all those guys did it today. How important was it to get back in sync today against these guys going into down Wayne State? Now? Well, I think the biggest thing is. Uh, they can go home enjoying, you know, a victory and having confidence that they know if they do it the tech way, we got a chance. Coach Ashland and Wayne State, early, early thoughts on them? Yeah, you know, uh, we got we to gotta enjoy the holidays for a couple days here, but I know that both those teams will be very tough. Uh, they always are. Ashland was picked to win to, to win it. They got the, the preseason player of the year and their big kid. Uh, two very tough clubs, GLIAC games, and... And uh, with the thing that will make it a, a, even a little tougher is we, 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 by rule, we can only practice Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. We can't start practicing till I believe that's the 30th. So uh, that whatever that Monday is uh, before the Thursday game. So we'll have three practices, and you got to go. And everybody in the country has got to do it. So I feel fortunate that we're at home for that reason. How do you feel the team is this year at the break compared to last year? Well, I, I, you know, we, we played well early last year. Yeah. We just ran out of gas at the end. But I, but I, I feel, you know, we're farther along, and, and we should be. So, the, you know, we have, a better, we have a better record, and that's what everybody's going to, you know, all the indications are. But uh, I feel like we're a little more fluid, and we have much more experience. So we should be better. But I, but I, think, I think we are better, and I think our guys are excited about where we can end up. Yeah, after last week not going the way we wanted to, we wanted to finish off the first half of the season strong, just execute our systems offensively and defensively, and we were able to do that tonight. How big was it to, to have another game this week after that tough loss on Sunday to come back out, maybe get some of that confidence yeah. built back up as you get ready to get back in the conference yeah. play after the new year? Last week left a bad feeling for all of us on the team, so it was nice to be able to get back to work, see all our hard work pay off this week, and. We're ready to go see our families at home for a little bit, but then get back after it for the second half. What's Christmas break look like Look like for you? Is it you go into next week, get a little bit of time off away from basketball? Yeah. Still be working some, getting the gym some, but it'll be nice to see the family be home for a little bit, see family and friends, and just spend some time relaxing. Yeah, what are some uh, Christmas traditions that, you're, that yeah. are your favorite years? For us, it's just getting the whole family together, just being able to spend time together all under one roof. Yeah, I get the whole day, just eat some good food and just hang out together. Yes, looking forward, uh, I guess your thoughts on, on Wayne and, and Ashland, you get to stay at home again yeah. uh, starting the second part of the year. Yeah, Wayne and Ashland are always some tough teams, so we'll, we'll have to prepare and be ready for them. 
This home stretch has been nice. It's not often we get to play this many in a row, but we'll enjoy it while we can.